so in this uh, video we are going to see the practical part of the previous one uploading a file so all those uh, that is restricting the size restricting the type all this is also we are going to see so the first program is csv file.html where we have the input name user file and type equal to file this will this is responsible for creating that browse button now we are going to see how it gets secured so if this calls the file name called php file in action we have given php file. so it will redirect to this where we have this we uh, read that file and uh, display the content on the screen this is the program this already you have seen in the uh, i have given the explanation of this in the previous video so we will see how it gets executed first you have to run the html file dot html so it will be like this now you have to select the browse button and you can select now see here on the send file so since it is a png file it's coming like that so now let me select some other file so now i have not given any checking in that php file it comes like that html we select some other file So here we go to the HTTP docs. Now I select some PHP file. Okay, so some PHP file or HTML. Anything I can select. Send file. See here, the content of the PHP file is displayed on the screen. So this is how it works. Now we'll see the next program. What I have explained. Uh, PHP file one. Yes. Here is this with the label. Here is the label. So I'll say browse. So let me select some file, small file. Now see here invalid file, and the size is less than. It is very small. So why it is giving me like this because the, here it is executing upload file 3 where upload file 3 is expecting see here only this type jpeg so now i uh, let me change the coding here in upload file 1 we have this so first upload file let me execute upload file 1 where the upload file 1 what we are doing is we are checking for the error and if no error, it just display the properties of the file. What is the name, temporary name, type, size, etc. So we will execute this now. Let's... So here, again, I'm selecting that. Anyway. So, see here, array.php file upload is successful here i haven't given any restrictions so it's just the php file and whatever is what is a temporary name and where it is to the full path is also displayed then what is the type of the file it is a php file and then the size all these things are displayed okay now we'll change this php file let me read php file 2 Where PHP file 2, we have this restriction. So you have to add only JPEG PNG and the file size should be less than this. If it is more than also, it will show you the error. So now we'll execute this. PHP file section. Now if I select other than the PNG, it will be already we have seen error. It has shown the error. So let me take some. This JPEG, which is 
48 KB. Definitely it has to show the error. Because invalid file, that is because it is more than that. Even if it is a PNG file, because of the size, it's showing me the error. So now I run again and I'll show you file which has plus. Uh, this is also more KB. So let us select something else. Pictures are a small ABCD. It has less, that is less than 20 KB. So now I just select. See here, since it is 6.7, which is nothing but less than our uh, even condition, that is 20. Then you divide it by 1024, it comes around 19 KB and all. So since it is less than, because uh, here it is 6.7 KB only, take use. And where it is stored in the template, that also is same. Okay, now we'll, we'll move to the upload file 3. Here, what we have done is we are moving the file, uploaded file to a, another location, from the temporary location to, actually it is not uh, moving, a copy is made. So now we'll see, so before that we'll change this file name to upload 3. Because we are going to use the same interface. Okay. So, one, browse. Let me select the same. Here also again, 30,000. If you uh, remember, here, see here, uh, in upload file 3, it allows up to uh, 30,000 means less than uh, 29, 29 KB like that you can say. So, here, yeah, this if you select all these things, definitely error will come. So let me select some lesser. So we'll select more 16 folder. If I select this, I'll show you what error it comes because it is already stored in the folder. So it will give you error. See, it already it, it actually it will not give you error, but the file is not moved because it's already that it counter already existed. Show you. So now we'll select some uh, something else. I we'll exit it again, and we'll select some other mod eight. Okay, it's not selected. So see here, this is so from this it is uh, moved to oh, this upload. Now I'll show you where it is to. You can find it in upload under the PSP library. Now I'll show you that. Uh, see here. OPT, LAMP, HVDOC, PHP, VRGS, and upload file. See that, see? Already I have executed this program, so it's coming. Let us mod 8 counter, just copy to this. Previously it was in temp file. See here. We have the name. So, Just move from there to 